Siobhan, mm -hmm. can I talk about something serious? Yeah, sure. Okay, so Dan was saying that Jeff from accounting may be sexually harassing some of the women in the office. Do you know anything about this? Yeah, I've been telling you for years. You have? Yeah, no, Jeff is an incubus, like a demon spirit that molests women, look. <laughs> You're saying Curly Dick Jeff is a sex demon? Well, it's not like he's been particularly secretive about it. I know, it's just kind of a surprise. You know, he's such a good guy. Jeff, what the hell? I never got my paycheck last week. Alright, cool. Thanks for looking into it. You're a really good dude. I mean, it's almost as if you've all been willfully ignoring it. I just can't believe it, you know? Guys, did you hear that Jeff was accused of sexual harassment? No, it's so surprising. Jeff's such a good guy. Yeah, like a really, like, good, good man. Please stop saying that he's a good guy. He's an incubus. I thought incubus was a band. It's also a sex demon, like Jeff. You, though, I'm disappointed in you. What? Yeah. You knew about this Jeff stuff, and you didn't say anything. I've been telling you for years. We have all been telling you for years. Nobody did anything about it. We had to create a secret Slack group just to know where he was at all times. It's called Jeff Watch. Hey, Siobhan, I saw you weren't on Jeff Watch. Just so you know, he's in the women's restroom. Thank you. So you had to make a whole channel just for women for this? Yeah. You can't do that. That's discriminatory. Don't sexist against us. First of all, that is not a verb. And second of all, you are the ones being sexist. I mean, why did you believe Dan and not me? There's something about when you explained it that didn't feel believable. Shrill. Mm. But when, when Dan described it, the, the truth just exploded all over. Okay, no, why did you even hire him? I felt bad for him. He had a really rough childhood. Yeah, you know, he was summoned by a wizard, and he had to survive on his own for years, just eating stolen babies. Do not feel bad for him. Feel bad for all of the women whose lives have been affected by him being a fucking creep. Oh my god, he's going into heat. He's going into heat! <laughs> Those beards are for protection? I thought your faces were just cold. So is Jeff gonna be fired? Oh, well, there's going to be an investigation. Oh. You know, we need to give him a chance to give him a chance. Only 26 women have come forward so far, so it's just a case of he said, she said. She said. She said. She said, she said. She said, she said, she said, she said, she said. She said. She said. She said, she said, she said. She said, she said, she said, she said, she said. She said. She said, she said, she said, she said, she said. So really, who knows what happened? Oh, and if you talk about this with anyone else, just remember that you need to use the word allegedly. We don't want to besmirch his reputation. Jeff's a really good guy. Oh. She said. Hi, it's Katie Mirovich from College Humor. If you want to subscribe, click over here. And for more fun stuff, click over here. And if you want access to College Humor's secret site, make sure you send your social security number, your credit card information, and your